Lack of guile with regard to that cross. Goalkeeper's ball. Declan Rice. Here's Manuel Lanzini. Jared Bowen. Takes some progress with the ball at his feet. In position. Oh, a moment of pure class. Had to catch it perfectly. And didn't he just? Antonio and doing all he can to grab his second of the game. Well, he's been a real live one. Can he deliver it with accuracy? In it goes! A three goal cushion, and you truly sense it's a matter of how many. He's up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. to intervene for Niles Rice with it oh that's a pass of high quality another goal the lead grows to four now a rapid... the weight of the through ball is key to this goal and once he gets onto it he just smashes it past the team but he's not going to be best pleased with himself Craig Dawson. It's with Yarmolenko. No potential danger. And he's in. And a goal it is. No long wait for the opener today. The goal again. And what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs... Looking for the equaliser. Clean challenge. Dangerous looking through ball. In it goes! Delighted to be two in front. Things look good for them now. Second in the league table in terms of goals. He's been so clinical and ruthless, and I expect him to get more today. Declan Rice. Lanzini. Now potential danger. There it is, and he could scarcely have had an easier finish. He's driven in the corner. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Oh, and it goes! Now he has his hat-trick, a special moment for him. Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. Well, the ball lost here. Rice. a very assured performance wasn't it particularly impressed with their play going forward really lively and almost cutting through at will at times the result never much in doubt if I'm honest well I believe a spot kick award in one of the other games let's hear all about it from Alex yeah it was a penalty for Palace it's hit the post and gone in the goalkeeper had no chance it's now 1-0 with 20 minutes played many thanks Alex and he could really get at the opposition. Giving it a try. And he's got it scored to level it again.
moving forward effectively and played in and the danger still on well nothing productive really well let's see what they have in store for them on the break can they take advantage of the situation oh yes a goal exactly what they were looking for Sam Maxima on the ball Mikael Antonio in with a chance and it's in 1-0 they breach the defence hey, watch how he goes past his man with such ease and it's just a change of pace and it makes the striker's job so easy all he has to do is make the right connection it's a lovely goal on Bonner Fredericks. Rice with it. Sam Axima. This looks more than decent. And a goal! It is! Lanzini has a go. Still alive. Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. Really intense pressure applied. Rice couldn't keep it. Well, something has happened at one of the other venues. Let's get the up to date news from Alex. Yeah, it was a penalty for Villa. Oh, in with a chance. The referee has given a. Well, nicely cut out and the counter-attack is on options available really nice ball and now can he keep calm and it's two for him today a masterful performance the defender well, we have 20 minutes left in this game well, what can they do to stop him running at them not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. It must go in, surely. And a goal! Not over just yet. Well, as we look at the table, the visitors have been dazzling us with their attractive brand of football, playing to their potential and then some, Stuart. Well, a lot of pundits said they couldn't keep up their excellent displays, but they're proving everybody wrong, including me. They are playing brilliantly at the moment and deserve to be top. Ronaldo untidy with the ball. Antonio. And he's broken free. And a goal! An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. Sit with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. This equaliser. This could be the equaliser, but no, when your goalkeeper comes up with a save like that late in the game, you have cause to be thankful. Well, that could be a key moment. They have to take those sort of chances. They won't get too many more, but let's credit the goalkeeper. Antonio. Dangerous ball. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop it. Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Disappointing pass. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Watford facing West Ham United. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Beautifully disguised ball, and into the back of the net. 
Well, they paid the price for their negligence. They let them come at them. And now of the Carabao Cup semi-final coming up for you live on EA TV. It's West Ham United facing Manchester City. to the advanced position and played in oh my goodness he's caught that so well a goal of the highest class fantastic technique into the box just begging someone to get on the end of it and then just look at this finish Derek he does so well to read the bounce often you can send these into the there but he makes the perfect contact stunning goal really Declan Rice, wonderfully weighted pass. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. There's the referee's whistle, and it is official now. The visitors are on their way to the final. Well, those celebrations will be going on for a long time now because they know just how good they've been over the two legs. They'll certainly fancy their chances in the final if they play like that. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for? Delivered into the area here. Able to deal with the threat. Antonio. There is the goal to open the scoring. Who can say they don't deserve to be in front? Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. They're really pressing their opponents. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Well, closed down straight away. Antonio, oh, in with a chance, and there is the goal, he's found the net, joy unconfined. No real conviction in the challenge. Well, thumps clear. Again, look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Defence of Brazilians to shut them down. Sam Maxima. Kufal on the ball. Lanzini. Suchek. Pablo Fornals, and played in, and a goal to give them the lead, they have their reward. Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better played into just the right area but just look at the space he has he doesn't even have to jump of course it's a good finish but the marking is woeful forward for the goalkeeper Stuart well he has to do better there that's a really poor finish well that would have been game over but unless they show more quality going forward there's just no way back oh big them. chance here and a goal to delight the fans just what they were and he goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder and then the shot could not be hit any better oh surely that is a tackle and a half 
Antonio. Oh, what a perfect ball now. How about this? And he's found a bit of daylight. Oh, there's the goal! There's the opener! How about that? Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. But how has he allowed that much time and space? He doesn't even have to jump to head it in. It's a good finish, but terrible defending. Conte now. Conte. Crisp tackling. Oh, showing excellent vision. Now, will they do it from here? Superb finish. Press well. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. Now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.